Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to the channel for another Mob Battle Mondays. And today I have something very exciting. We are, this mob featuring today is the first time it's ever been in the Mob Battle. Well, on my channel anyway. So I'm very excited to see how it stacks up against some other mobs. But before we get into that today, guys, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and then slap that like button. You know what I do. It really helps me out. It really helps the channel out. Helps us grow more as a community as well. Helps me do more videos for you guys to enjoy also. But anyway, let's crack on with the episode. So today we have Geron. And uh, he is a awesome, awesome mob from the Greek Fantasy mod. Now, I've had to put him in, in the mob spawner from the mob battle mod. Because you have to spawn him in in a specific way. And I don't want to have to do that every single time. So we've saved him in here. Don't worry, he has all of his abilities still. You can see there, Geron is the mob saved into it. And he's going to be going up against what I'd class as another fantasy mod ice and fire now we have him going up against a mimrix actually i want to swap that to a mimrix royal because the queen doesn't really do much the dread lich cyclops fire dragon lightning dragon and hydra now <laughs> this is going to be awesome i'm super hyped for this and yeah so let's do it let's get on with it um okay mr garon please get up in here with your 160 HP. Now I know what you're thinking. He does look like he has a lot less health than a lot of the ice and fire mobs. But that's what we're here to see. It's it's a mob battle. We're here to see how he does. Alright, so let's try the Mimrix Royal first. Uh no, there we go. Okay, okay. So go do it, guys. Okay, so he's spawned in a mad cow as backup. And he is powerful with that club that is an iron club he is beasting this mimrix royal i don't think the mimrix royal is really dealing any damage no dealt hardly any damage do i yeah we'll just get rid of him uh, we'll get a new one up in here damn strong and that's enchanted as well <laughs> nice and drops diamonds with a shield he is awesome he is a sick mob if you guys haven't seen me do the review or tutorial on the greek fantasy mod check it out because some of the mob bosses in it are mad and we will definitely do some more mob battles with some of the other bosses at some point all right dread lich literally wasted no time and straight away mad cow spawned in Geron is not wasting any time at all. That mad cow is on a mad one. Okay, go on, Mr. Geron. Okay, he is getting very injured by these other mobs. He is getting taken down by the little minions. But if he can get one or two hits in on the Dread Lich, he is good to go. So he's just got to really take these guys down now. I think he's, he's killed the Dread Lich. He did. He one hit the Dread Lich. Will he take these guys out or will he die? It's not looking good. It's not look Okay, one, or t one skeleton left. One. Oh, he's only gone and done it. He's done it. Yes, Geron. I had the faith in you. I always was a believer. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What maneuvers and abilities from this guy. For a second, I did think... He was going to die against the Dread Lich. Not going to lie to you. Not going to lie to you at all. Um, but pulled it back from the brink of defeat. It took a one hit from him to the Dread Lich and it killed him. So the Dread Lich really needed to spawn in more mobs. I did spawn the Dread Lich far enough away. And as you saw, it did spawn in an ample amount of mobs to help him out. So yeah, I'm pretty chuffed with that. The Mad Cow still <laughs> running around. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Okay, now the real test. Will this guy, uh, giant versus Cyclops. Okay, let's do this. Let's see how it goes. Oh, wow, the Cyclops is a lot bigger um, than he is. I thought they were roughly the same height. I'm not going to lie. 
Okay, so he can't do his pick up and eat ability because Garon is just too big. Oh, and Garon is having him with that club. Okay, the Cyclops can't really do too much. Okay, no, Garon, you were doing better from a distance, bro. You really need to keep the Cyclops at a distance. Don't bother spawning in the cows. I don't quite know what they're doing for you. I don't think they're... Oh, okay. Okay, the cow is doing a little bit. All right, so... You keep spawning in cows aimlessly, I would say. Um, okay, how's the side? Oh, it's close. It is. It's close. This is amazing. Garon versus Cyclops. This is brilliant. Okay, I want to see some more abilities from Garon, though. I'm not going to lie to you. There are a few cows running around now, which is pretty insane. Okay, come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. That, that cow's sort of fighting the spider. The spider's sort of trying to get involved. Oh, oh, that's a power move from Geron. He's just got to keep this guy at a distance, and he's done it, really. He's doing phenomenally well. I honestly had my money on the Cyclops. I'm not going to lie to you. I thought this Geron would do good. Oh, oh, it's come down to the wire. Cyclops literally had two HP left. If the Mad Cows can do it, if this Mad Cow can somehow take down two HP of the Geron... I'm going to give it to the, as a draw. Um, but no, the, the Mad Cow's going to die because the Garon's dead. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That that was amazing. That that was awesome. I loved that. That was neck and neck. That really came down to the wire. Whew. Whew, that was good. Okay. <laughs> so, let's spawn him in again. And let's get him up against a Fire Dragon. Not this little baby one. Oh, I know I can feed him dragon meal or something. So maybe maybe I'll just do that today. Um, where is it? Let's see if I can even see it. Let's just type it in. Let's go for dragon. Or is it bone meal? I've, I've got to feed them. I've completely forgotten. Um, let's go for it. See if we can just give some bone meal. But I was pretty sure it was specific. Let's see if I can. I probably should have had this up beforehand. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, no! No! Kieran! No! Why have you done that? Uh, instantly tame dragon mode. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's go for this. And let's see if we can grow a dragon. Okay, here we go. Perfect. You're going you're gonna to grow? You're going to... I mean, just, just have the bone meal. Just, just, it's, you're being a nuisance. Just eat it. Eat it. Why are you like this? Why are you like, ah, oh, stuff it. I'm sure everyone will tell me what I'm doing wrong in the comment sections. But, oh well, there you go. It happens. Okay, so this guy has 204 HP versus the Garon with 160. I feel like that is a fair matchup. Wow, you put that guy's cow down, bully. Whoa, that magma block is going to deal some damage. But Geron is doing some mad damage himself. Uh, wow, is that a new ability or a new move, rather, from this fire dragon? Because I haven't seen that sort of whirlwind, sort of flight, crash, landing ability thing before. Um, it, it just looks new to me. Um, unless I just haven't been paying that much attention. Okay, so Garon is getting injured, but not drastically. Nothing compared to the Fire Dragon. It is minimal. I know everyone's going to say, well, you should have spawned in a stage 3, Kieran. Well, I feel like that's not a super duper fair matchup. But this most certainly is. The level 2 Dragon had more health. And, yeah... Should he had the aerial advantage as well, so I don't really feel sorry for it. Wow, wow, Garon smashed that against a level two dragon. But let's see if we can get a level three uh, lightning dragon in here next. Okay, so you're here. Let's see. No, terrible. Go away. Uh, maybe I'll tame it with some meal actually. Um, stunts. Why would I want to stunt its growth? Why would I want that? Okay, let's go for it here. I want to give you this. Okay, you, are you, are you, you happy? You, ha you happy? 
Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes! Done it now. Okay, it's a big dragon. It's a... Oh, no, I don't want to ride you, though. I just want to give you the bone meals. Okay, let's see how high we can take this guy. Okay, yep, yeah, yeah, it's very big. It's a big dragon. We've got a big dragon on our hands. Yep, that's... Yeah, wow. Wowzers. Okay, I'm definitely doing this in the future. That's right. Maybe I went a bit. <laughs> maybe I went a bit too over the top. <laughs> I got a bit carried away with that one. But let's see how this goes. All right, let's do it. Geron, do your thing against this absolutely enormous lightning dragon. Um, okay. Geron saw. The okay, lightning dragon's running away. I know people say, do the dragons out the arena. Ah, maybe I will one day. Maybe today will be that day. Okay, Geron is slowly, slowly advancing and just spawning in lots of mad cows. Is he going for it? He's finally gone for the attack. Okay, so there we go. There we go. The, uh, the lightning dragon is fighting back. It is stuck in the arena. I am fully... Oh, it's burning the arena down. It is destroying my whole arena. Lovely stuff. Okay, yeah, maybe I should have definitely have spawned this guy outside the arena. Maybe that's what I should have done. Should, uh, do I do I just like blow the arena up? What am I thinking here? What am I thinking? Maybe I'm not thinking. Okay, let's go outside. Let's despawn everything and start again. Because that's one way to do it. Um, or we're just gonna have to kill this guy with the nope. Okay, nope. You 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 you're there. You're there. I'm sorry. You you you're gonna have to die, bro. You're gonna have to die. Okay, let's do it here. Let's get this dragon up in here. All right. Oh oh, I want the purple one. No, I don't want to ride you. I don't want to ride you. I just want to. Nope. Stop it. Okay. Yep. Yeah, this works. Yep, that, that, that works just fine. Okay, it's all very flashy. Okay, let's do it. Let's get the gear on back in here. And, uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Oh, reset. There we go. Love it. And, uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Now we're on. Now we are on. There can't be any complaints about it being done outside the arena now. Because that is what is happening. Uh, the, the lightning dragon is still... Oh, the mad cow has currently done the most damage. Um, okay, Lightning Dragon, is it going to throw any punches anytime soon? Or are you going to continue running away from the Geron? It, that, that appears to be what, what you sort of plan on doing, bro. Just, just, okay, no, taking a little, little nap. A little bit tired. Uh, just a little rest. No, going to straight up kill the cow and still running away from the Geron. Why are you like this? Just, just fight. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yes, that will have done it. Or is the lightning dragon still going to run away? Nope. He's, he's just going to stay there and take a beating. And it's his own fault that he's in the mountain. So I don't want to hear any complaints that I put the dragon in the mountain. He's being, they are being crushed by sand. This is, this is not what I had envisioned for this battle in the slightest. Um, but I guess it's a fight, sort of. It's a sort of fight. Um, the, the lightning dragon's gonna absolutely murk this guy. Uh, that, it, it's, there's no battle here really at all. It's a slaughter. Geron is getting destroyed by that lightning, even though the lightning dragon is being crushed currently by sand. Yes, sand is the real winner in this battle here. Oh, and it's, it's over. It's over. Okay, so I'm going to leave you to chill in your little cave, you massive scary dragon thing. And uh, <laughs> this one is still up here. Oh, I feel bad for that one. Okay, so final battle. We have Geron versus Hydra. My bets are on the Hydra for this because uh, the Hydra is ridiculous. And yep, as predicted, the Geron is getting murked straight away and the Hydra you can only really kill it with fire you, you can only really kill it with fire and that amount of poison being thrown out of that thing is ridiculous sure it's only doing like one HP worth of damage every time 
but it's still an obscene amount and it covers a wide area as well. That cow is proper going for it. He is very loyal. The cows are extremely loyal to the Geron. But let's see how the Geron's doing. He's dying extremely slowly. Whereas the Hydra is regening continually. And now has all of its nine heads, I think. I think it's at, it's at its full nine heads. It looks like that anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, he's only on six as of the moment. Oh, he'll be on nine momentarily, I'm sure. Okay, this will probably do it. Oh, wow. Okay, the Garon is, is pretty much over for the Garon, not gonna lie. The Hydra is just... It can only be taken down by a fire mob. Now, is there a fire mob in the Greek... Yes, there is! There's, um... What's the dog called? The dog... The Hades dog, I've immediately... Cerberus! That's it. Cerberus is in the Greek fantasy mod, so we might have to put Hydra up against Cerberus. But, there you go, this guy's dead. And the winner is, as normal, Hydra. And the cows are avenging their master. Sort of. They're giving it a good go. But, there you go, guys. That is today's mob battle. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comment section down below and what other mob battles you wish to see in the future. Is the Garon a mob favourite of yours, as it is mine? Also, I'd be interested to know that. But anyway, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, see ya.